I think someone's going to get their car repossessed from this parking lot this morning. White repo truck pulled in. He is a wrecker truck. And he just stopped right here. He's he's reading tags. I was waiting for him to stop in my car and let him know I own that bitch. So today is the day I have to leave here. Heading over to another hotel. Ugh. I sure hope I do find somebody. Alabama. Oh, her car stopped. Not Denny Repo, thank God. She's getting a jump start. All right, well, that was the exciting news for this morning. The Matthews are getting up. I don't know how I understand how these people on the first floor live here all year round. And the manager told me I couldn't stay or extend my stay for one week. You should be glad I was trying to extend my stuff for one week. But I will be giving it a bad Google review. I do do a lot of Google reviews when I travel. So that's what I will be experiencing. Like this this look at this the door is dirty all this is dirty all this dirty all this down here I will be expressing my concerns to the head corporate office of La Quinta I'm over there. All these rooms are just dirty. Look at this. You can even hire someone to wipe this crap down. I try to offer my services to them. They wouldn't take me. Nope. I sold my, I'll work it off my stay here. Nope. I come out here, have someone paint your shit, fix your stuff up. Look at the pool. Can you see the pool? Look at that pool. See all that? That's mold at the bottom of the pool. The pool cleaner came in here, just skimmed the pool, threw some chemicals in it, and left. The pool needs to be shut down, and it needs to be scrubbed down. I wouldn't even go swimming in that pool. Look at the pool deck. The pool deck is just nasty. Like, for sample, that chair, that awning over there. It's just dirty. It's a really dirty facility. Look at the trash trash has been piled up for days they talk about their housekeepers have to come in they didn't even service the girl did that puerto rican girl did not even service my room not one time i got blankets i got sheets from her and towels from her what am i supposed to use the same towel two towels they give you two people checking in there should be four towels in total two washcloths and two hand towels but four bathing towels. You didn't only gave me two bath towels, two wash, one washcloth, and one hand towel, one bath mat. Who does that? I work in hospitality, and we provide our guests a lot more than what they should get. But they get it. So they don't go without. You don't have no one out here straightening up the pool deck when you get in. They lock it down. They put locks on it after 10 o'clock. But, I mean... Come on, it's take pride in where you work. The manager can't run this shit. <laughs> Sorry for my language, but he can't run it. And the three people that work for him can't run it. The two housekeepers they have on duty, they can't clean all these hotels by themselves. They're understaffed. You should see what they give out for breakfast. You used to get hot breakfast. Nowadays, you just get a, a, a piece of bread and cellophane, muffins, coffee, juice, um, cereal milk nothing worth exciting about not for the $400 $468 let me correct myself with the tax and everything the bill was $468 for one week here at the La Quinta in Pinellas Park I wouldn't recommend it to nobody unless you like being around drug addicts all day long if you like being around drug addicts all day long then you're welcome to come and stay the room was kind of clean 
but they could do a lot better, especially provide clean sheets. I don't even think my sheets would change because I have a piece of red. I have a red um, blood stain that was on my sheets, and I told them it was unacceptable, and they got up here, and they cleaned it right away. But shit, man, can't do that to people that pay good money. Look at this. This is my windowsill. Coffee laying all down in here. This stuff coming from the air conditioner is molded. They need to, you know, someone slips and falls on that. What the hell? The windowsills, just dirty. Just really, really dirty. So if you were ever planning to come to the La Quinta in Pinellas Park, just keep on going a little further up and you'll find something different. Then don't stay at the roadway in because the roadway in turn into drug haven. But they do accept dogs down here, so that's pretty good. Alright, well have a good day.